All right, so I know you probably don't want to do trials, but they have gotten a really good grenade launcher. So the Cataphract grenade launcher is the only grenade launcher in the game right now that can roll bait and switch. And I'm going to be farming for this. So quick launch, spike grenades. And it's got a lot of really good PvE perk options. So in the first perk slot, we have Envious Assassin, which got above this season, which will overfill the magazine when you get kills with other weapons. We have Field Prep, which when we're crouched, will give us a faster reload speed. We have auto loading holster as well as demolitionist and in the second perk slot we have explosive light which is a good option we have hatchling which is good as well as chain reaction for ad clear and then we have bait and switch as well as full core which you know people like full court but really what separates this grenade launcher from the others is going to be bait and switch so this is a 35 percent damage increase that lasts 10 seconds so you pair this maybe with like auto loading holster if you want to run like burden and then shoot your smg pull out your grenade launcher and shoot as many shots as you can with your grenade launcher rock paint switch again by shooting burden or however you really want to do it you can even go like field prep to get as many shots off as possible or envious assassin if you're able to clear a bunch of ads before you do a damage phase which you usually are able to do so truthfully my personal favorite god roll is going to be envious assassin with bait and switch or i take field prep or auto loading but I'd mostly go for envious and field prep. Auto loading's always good, but I don't think I'm gonna want auto loading. I'd probably have something that's gonna allow me to get more shots off in the fastest way possible. But auto loading isn't a bad option at all. Just for my personal preference, I'm going field prep or envious assassin. This is gonna be available as just a normal drop. You don't have to go flawless to get this. You can get the normal version. But if you are able to go flawless, you can get the adept one and put adept mods on it. But you really don't need the adept one. You just gotta play trials and get a normal one don't have to just go for the adept version but i'm definitely going to be farming trials for this because this is a really good grenade launcher and having bait and switch on it is the only grenade launcher once again with bait and switch but i haven't seen this grenade launcher be too too much talked about yet i'm sure it will be but i want to go over this really quickly just to give you a heads up there is a reason to play trials for pve players and you're probably like well i don't want it i hate it blah 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 but i mean come on it's got bait and switch just Surfer through the grind you don't got to go flawless just get a normal one and try to get a good roll that's what i'll be doing so let me know if this video did help let me hear your thoughts on this grenade launcher maybe one rockets since they've already gotten that um gallahorn nerf maybe we'll slowly see grenade launchers take over especially now we got one with bait and switch but we'll see i don't know that will be meta yet but i'm excited to farm for this let me know your thoughts on this grenade launcher and i'll see you on the next one all right Peace.